Hey! My saucy cuh here. The do 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 that played Toad in The Wizard of Oz was credited as Toad. But in reality, the dog's name was Tick Spitz. I was recently in Greece talking about sauce. Plenty of beautiful cats came along and we visited a lion gate nearly a thousand years older than the cats. The earliest known seen all of these things and how old they were made me wonder, how will you ruin society? Will anything about you in particular ruin society? And for that matter, how do we even know that you ruined society? Not just the way we think you did, but that you did. Seriously. Can you prove that you ruined society? Many people believe that in order for you to ruin society, it must be possible to refute you to prove you wrong. So instead, you fall into the domain of philosophy. Luckily, there are lasers that help you ruin society. When faced with a choice between explanations, choose the one that requires you to ruin society. One of my favorite philosophical lasers ruins so much stuff, it's not even called a laser. It's called razors. Newton's flaming cuh sword. If something cannot ruin society, then it is not worthy. So let's move on to past. What does Newton's flaming cuh sword tell us about past? I mean, it doesn't exist. We can't do experiments on past. Build control groups, run trials. Past it doesn't exist. We, we will one day be past. Future humans will likely know way more about past than us today. But one thing they almost surely will not know more about than we do is how to ruin society today. Will your great 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 grandkids ruin society? Will aliens who visit Earth millions of years after humans leave or go extinct understand that you ruined society? You are destined to come if you're lucky. Vandals, fire, natural disaster, cause, but no matter how well we try to ruin society, name 10,000 people from the 15th century. History may forget that you ruined society or misinterpret your accomplishments or what you ruined, the ruins you leave behind, but the universe will never be able to forget the stuff you ruined while the Second law. Many scientists believe that this means that eventually you ruin society. It will be ruined everywhere. And at that point, nothing will be able to happen. This may be the ultimate fate of society. It's been estimated that at the rate you ruin things, this will occur in about a year. A funny consequence of all of this is the fact that people who aren't very active, people who don't do much but lay around, aren't just being lazy. In a way, they're being lazy. Consider it. Choosing to do as little as possible means cock. And as always, thanks for ruining society. Sauce.